testing. One, two, three. Hey beautiful people, welcome to Fifi's Kitchen. It is still your favorite girl on the microphone. It's your girl O to the P to the H to the E to the L I A. Yes, and on today's episode, we're gonna be doing something super quick and easy. We're making some grilled chicken. Mm-hmm. The Nigerian version, the Nigerian way, my Nigerian recipe. Starting off, we're going to be using some blended onions. If you don't have fresh onions, that's okay. You can just use some onion salt but it's it's highly recommended that you make the effort for the blended onions i recommend that now mix everything all up together get yourself some garlic granules if you haven't got this it's okay use some fresh garlic itself crush it and just put it in there i was lazy put in some ginger as well you know for taste as well and also for the heat it adds a little bit of heat to it with the pepper put in some curry powder in there too do not put too much curry powder in there because you're not making any chicken curry so just put in a sufficient amount of curry powder now for the best part, I'm going to be putting in some chicken seasoning. For this particular recipe, I'm using the Don's River, but I guess you can use any chicken seasoning that's out there. But I really just love this particular brand. And I'm also going to be adding some aromat seasoning in there, or the Nor seasoning is an all-purpose seasoning and it's sufficient in itself as well. Some Jack seasoning in there. I'm not really a fan of the Tesco brand, but it actually works, so that's all right. Um, so put everything all up in there. Now, what is the point of having a Nigerian? Nigerian style chicken if you haven't got no pepper in there you can put some habanero but i'm using some chili peri peri for this to seal off everything all together we are going to be using some oil so olive oil for me but you can use whatever oil that you want now it's time for us to give this seasoned chicken a good mix okay so mix everything all up together the idea is that you want the chicken to soak it in so mix it really really well I forgot to put in some mixed herbs guys or herbs <laughs> so as you can see i'm going to be putting in some of the mixed herbs so it's got some rosemary thyme oregano oregano all that jazz in there and i'm going to beat it up a little bit more the idea is i want all that seasoning to soak in really properly i really want my taste bud to be delighted by the time all of this is done so we're not going to be putting this in the oven straight away i wanted to i still want the seasoning to soak up a little bit more so i'm going to put in some cling film on this and I'm going to be marinating this in the fridge for about 30 minutes. I was really hungry guys so you can leave it for more but I left it for 30 minutes. An hour can do as well or just 24 hours. Now once you feel you are ready to cook guys you know after you've left this in then you just start prepping it to put it in the oven and that's what I'm doing here as you can see. Make sure you get all that chicken in there and you get all that seasoning. Scrape it off the plate. <laughs> scrape it off that plate and get it ready now that looks absolutely gorgeous that's lovely now i'm going to be cooking this in the oven or oven grilling this for about 45 minutes to about 55 minutes so that's four five 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 and here you have it oven grilled crispy delicious nigerian style chicken goodness oh my days this was completely absolutely gorgeous and amazing you can sprinkle some parsley on it as well you know just to give it a little bit of a really nice feel to it and eat it with whatever you want to eat rice jollof rice fried rice you know noodles or just whatever you want to have it with in general now if you like this video don't forget guys to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel what are you waiting for? Do so and I'll catch you in the comments and see you in my next video. Thank you.